And with that, hello everyone and welcome back to Tales of Vesperia. I wasn't streaming yesterday, that's why I'm streaming today. And I've got a webcam, or sort of webcam going right now. Still using my phone, just so I could be a little bit um, desynchronized. I'm not sure, I hope I've got it worked out a little bit. Um, We'll see how it'll go. It's definitely now... Um, I, I didn't know where to put the webcam or face cam. Um, so I put it on the upper right corner. Hopefully that'll be okay. I'm not sure. My lighting situation is not really great, but I hope you can see everything, especially when we get like to a dark scene. Right now we have a bright monitor or a bright thing going on here. So, I don't know if it will... Um, let me go into the game, actually. That and that, there we go. So yeah, um, we're back in Darncrest. Um, I don't know if it will be bad if we get into like a black area. We also got a skid right now, we're gonna see that in a second. Um, off screen, I uh, fiddled a little bit around with skills um, and activated uh, some skills which were more necessary than other ones, uh, deactivated some other ones. Um, I also saw that Carol apparently had like minimum and quarter damage activated. That's probably the reason why he didn't do any damage. That could be a thing, couldn't it? So, the fight last time could have been possibly easier if we had Carol in the party without those two things. Maybe, I don't know, but we made it in the end, this giant buck. Creature, we, we defeated it. We could go back and defeat this one giant yeti. I'm not sure if I really want to do this though. Um, for now, we're probably gonna explore the city a little bit. Um, what the face game is, by the way, working now that I'm hosting a, a streaming service on my PC and my phone is loading it up to the streaming server. Somehow, I don't know exactly, but I don't have any feedback now, I can't see me in there. I only see me over here in OBS, so we'll see. Hopefully it will work out for the stream, we'll see. If it, I initially disabled it in the Yakuza because it was lagging like hell, but the issue was somewhere else, so I could have left it like it was, but I wasn't quite happy with the USB method. Um, so right now we're using that one, and it seems to work quite okay, um, it's not too bad, but we'll see. Um, anyway, we are back in Dunquist, we're probably gonna talk to everybody, that's at least the plan. And first of all, we're gonna review the skit, the Don. Don Whitehorse. <laughs> I can see how a man like that could rise to the top of the Union. He's pretty impressive. I'm just relieved he's the sort of person who's willing to listen. I didn't think he'd give us a chance, considering that he's never met us before. That's what makes the Don so great! I told you, right? Man, he's so cool! Do you run his fan club or something? <laughs> yeah. Carol is... Uh, this, this, this is something we can investigate here? No. Um, Carol is quite proud of the Don, apparently. Something is stuck, there's nothing inside here, and that one is full of equipment which we can't take. Let's have a look at this place here. Can we buy anything? I think we did that at the end of the last stream. Got plenty of stuff here. Compact sword, we don't need that at the moment. Holy circlet, nobody needs that. Nobody needs stuff like that. Could get a thief's cape, theoretically. We uh, stocked up on items here. Okay, can we synthesize anything? I know, what do we need for that? Air or Jeric? I don't know where I get those. It might be a pretty useful. What are those? Miracle Gel? We're still 60% of max HP and TP. We need a Pineapple Gel, we need Lemon Gel, Medical Herb. It costs 2000 to do that specific. 30% of max TP for all party members. That's not too bad. Well, it costs 3,000, so I don't really want to use that right now. Um, Weapon-wise, we're pretty good to go as well. Endless Heart plus one, that's new. Then with the king's eyes, the bell plus one. 
We have the sash already, so let's get the king sized belt and the endless heart. Alrighty. Chain whip, we got that one already. Taro. A holy raven plus one. What do we need for that? We need a hoof. We don't have a hoof right now. Okay, anything nice to get here? Kite shield, spike collar, I think we got all those already. And nothing really nice to get around here. Got a battle suit, which we could get too. And we could get to extra care when to do making of each and every joint of this armor. It is a masterpiece of mobility and durability. Um, yeah, we could get two of them, why not? One and two. Anything nice here? Battle guard, ember cloak, feather cloak, witch dress. Let's check it. We got the steel protector. I think Hip is apparently better though. And then we could create a magic mist or Sephira. Sculpture of an unnamed god is equipped to earn 1.5 times more gold. That sounds pretty good. We need tree box for that. We'll create some of that if we wanted to. I'm sure, if I want to use those on. Moon Selector, I can get that one now. Change the controlled character during battle by opening the menu and pressing the select button, I guess. I can get that one. That's fine. I don't want the rest of them. Alrighty, so let's go to equipment. We want to get the new battle suit. You and you have a new item. Endless Heart or the King's Eyes Belt. Let's start with the King's Eyes Belt. And Carol gets a battle suit as well. Why not? Alrighty, we got some new items. Rita, we're gonna look at your equipment right now. We've got a cross counter. Which increases when an attack hits an, 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 an attacking enemy. We can get rid of strength if you don't really need strength. Critical magic might be pretty good. Um, God Plasma, we could get rid of. Oh, we don't really need Black Stab. Birds is nice. Taunt, happiness, yeah. I don't really need experience share actors until in the active party. Definitely one critical magic, that's for sure. We have two points left, which we could spend on something. If we wanted to, but we don't really have anything, so why does one activate experience share? That's fine. Okay, so we're good to go on that one. Let's go all the way up here. Um, we start from one, why not? There we go. Um, we are healed up, aren't we? Yes, we are. So, let us go. That's fine, that looks fine, okay. So, we're gonna go... ...over here and explore the city a little bit. Yeah, that's a little bit dark when it's transitioning to that, but I guess it's fine. Fishier and fishier. Probably about Raven. I never would have thought Raven was a member of Altosk. It looked like he and the Dawn were close. The old man probably has a pretty important job. Uh, yeah. It's hard to believe, but he's probably one of Altosk's top officers. The fact that he can leave town on guild business shows the Dawn trusts him. That old man. You can't judge a book by its cover, Rita. Fishier and fishier. Alrighty. So we're gonna start going into this place, the cooking stadium. Getting attacked by a huge pack of monsters right after arriving, huh? Having fun yet? Okay, we know that already. Let's enter. And see if there's anything new going on here. Welcome to the Gourmet Bangay's Bistro Black Hole Cooking Stadium. The days, days without events are open to the public, so we hope you enjoy yourselves. Don Whitehorse again. I can't believe that old fogey beat me. Did you really plan on beating him? The 
There's no way! He's a living legend! No one could take him down! Yeah, but being in shape like that at his age would be enough. I got nervous just hearing you were gonna fight him. Why is that? Most kids that square off against him end up in bed for a week with half a dozen broken ribs. What drunk told you that? It's the honest truth. Count your lucky stars he was in a sporting mood. I heard he herded up a hundred of those turtle monsters with the spiky shells and killed them all at once. And there's a legend that when Don Grest's barrier was failing, he took a chain and fixed it himself. No human could do that. But I'll beat him one day. I swear. You still planning on winning? That kid's a ball of stubborn pride. Okay, it was weird. The audio quality quality was a lot worse than the other skits for some reason. I guess that was an old skit. The best ingredients, kitchen and chef there can be. The result has to be delicious. But if even one of those is missing, you cannot make a fine meal. Oh, this party is his master artisan steel made by the Soho Smiths. Conducts and retains heat better than anything else out there. We already know all of that, so nothing changed around here from the looks of it. And we can talk to a guy who is disguised as a cow. Hey, I'm not an ingredient, so don't try anything funny. Training to become a master chef. Supposed to have been eating so far, though. <laughs> okay. If he says so. That really was something. What a city. The citizens defend it all by themselves. And that man, the one they called the Don. Wow. Human marks. That's where we come in. Okay. I just don't know about those knights. To show sure we're late. We really need to Don in this town. Even if the Empire attacks, the Don will beat them up good. Even if the. Yeah, we know that. Don will fight them. Hey, the Empire's gonna attack. Better stock up on equipment where you can. We'll make it cheap. So the Empire is going to attack? Interesting. You there, sir. Won't you take a look at what we have to offer? Now we can finally make on, take on those idiots from the Empire. We'll show them a thing or two. Okay. First monsters, now the Empire. How pathetic. Okay, so the Empire is going to attack from the looks of it. Well, that was a surprise, because things like this really do happen. No, no, I didn't run. We fought all proper like Me too. So the Empire is going to attack. I wonder why. There's got to be a reason for it. What's in here in the number one store? Does it have the same as the number two store? Something else. Hey, is it true the Empire is coming to attack us? We'll, we'll be okay, right? I'll be a merchant and be scared of the Empire and the Imperial Knights. Door number one. Do you sell anything special? You have Malange gels, which we could technically buy, but... Oh, you sell pineapple gels as well. Wow. That is actually tempting to get some pineapple gels going. Like four of them. Sure, let's do that. There's a king's ice belt, we already had those. Holy circlet, don't we need more? At the moment, at any rate, and that's just still selling the same stuff. Don't have anything new to synthesize, do you? Yeah. Seems about right. Okay. Hey, do you want to know about synthesizing? Casually a grubber. Okay, nothing really interesting. EP Oka eggs. A white hat. Stylish, elegant white hat. Useless during battles. What completes your outfit? Okay, I guess I already have those. Arrival edge plus 1A. Guess I already have that one as well. Oh, Horse Raptor. Where do I get a Horse Raptor? At the Swendel Isles. Okay. Not sure where those are, but okay.
Step right up, feast your eyes on these wares. You can't buy stuff like this in the Empire. Conquest is the best. With all the guilds banded together, monsters are no match for us. I don't want to talk to you, I want to talk to the lady here. Hey, what do you think you're doing just wandering around? Ah, you got a problem, buddy? So, you heard the news? It's just a rumor, but they say the Empire is behind the monster attacks. It's still just a rumor. Union headquarters are bad. Do you want to see the done? Guy's scary. Don't say I didn't warn you if you pee in your pants. There are some people who get so nervous they can't speak in front of the Don. Probably Carol. Or you. See, I was right, the Don took care of things. But this town has always been that way, see? Nothing no, to worry about. I go in here? The Crimson Stars? No, I can't go to the Crimson Stars yet. There's still a bunch of barrels. Mysterious. You can't rely on anybody from the Empire. I don't give a damn about common people. Stuck up a little. You wanna see the Don? There's no way the Don would meet with kids like you. Even if he did, he'd kill you in an instant. I'm so pleased the barrier is back in operation. Now we can rest easy. Okay. We can go into the tavern. Monsters went away while well, we're still wondering whether to fight or not. I guess that's what I was asking for, but I'm a little disappointed. I'm a little disappointed I didn't get to show what I can do. Ah, uh, the barriers got fixed. We already know that. Sometimes the solidarity of the guilds can be a painful thing. People with conviction who get bound by the rules can often do crazy things. Even without a barrier, I ain't gotta be a cell, doesn't mean you can still have on. Not afraid of any monsters. I'm the owner here, can I get you anything? Hey, don't try anything on the part timer. I'm not going anywhere, even if the barrier fails. I'm not taking my eyes off the waitress. Have you heard? The barrier was fixed. Yeah, we already know all of that. Do you say anything new, old man? So, Jeff, first of all, one or two barriers going bad. So they don't really have anything new to say around here. Um, can we go any further here? No, we can't. But there's some. There was someone here. Like right there. Yeah. Oh, there we go. So we heard of the monster tag. It doesn't change the fact that monsters still exist. A piece of darkness depends on this barrier blast. Yeah. My job protecting the barrier blast here is a very important one. Therefore, my job is very rewarding. Can I go through you? No. Okay. Those towns look always a lot taller than they actually are. At least the accessible parts. Can I go here? No. The only reason we managed to get out of that massive minimum losses is our union's leadership. But Don is a great man. We go to right or left? No? Alright, let's enter the chambers. I, I never actually fought monsters before. They're terrible. My, my hands are still shaking. My hands are still shaking. Beyond this point are the private rooms of Union officials. If you are here to see the Don, it's the last room. You're not allowed past this point. Alright. Prison. We have to check out what's happening in Cave Mark. I think it's southwest of the town. Most of Cave Mark is to the southwest of town, but I wouldn't go if I were you. It's dangerous. 
Uh, I don't need a weakling like you. Yeah, we're definitely still pretty weak. I think the max level is around, well, the max level is still 200, but Endgame is around level 60 or something like that. At least the Dawn was level 60. Oh, why? Why is he missing? That was a guard before, yeah. Stated way. Shut it on D me B. Open everyone up. Yeah, there used to be guard here, but he's missing. That's interesting. I wonder if something will happen in the prison then. Dun's chamber. I wonder if everyone will be around here. So you've come Off back, then. have you? Yuri. What? You two know each other? Yes. We're old friends. You don't say. I see you know Yuri as well. We crossed paths during the assault on the city. Now then, what business did you have? Uh... We came to ask you about a man named Barbos of the Blood Alliance. It looks like he's the one behind the recent string of stolen Blastia cores. I see. So Barbos is tied up in your problem as well. You have a problem with him, too? We have come to ask that the Union relinquish all ties with the Blood Alliance. Well, that's a little bit of... Uh, that's a bit much, isn't it? Other guilds have begun to follow Barbos' example, abusing Blastia in other areas and disrupting the order of society. If we can count on your assistance, I feel that together we should move to put an end to the Blood Alliance. Barbos? <laughs> He's been testing the limits of my patience lately. Looks like it's time to remind that brute how a proper guild behaves. A clash between the guilds and the Empire was avoided the other day, largely due to your intervention. However, if Barbos is left unattended, the relations between our two states may yet again be torn apart. And that's not going to be fun for anybody. The time for stopping Barbos is now. Oh, so he's in on that? Since we'll be cooperating with you, I assume we'll be on equal standing with the Empire in this. Yes, sir. Huh. If that's the case, a united front with the Empire might not be such a bad idea. Then... Yeah. We'll deal with this together. Hey, send a message to Bellius. <laughs> Tell Bellius that Nordopolica's gonna help us. Man, this is serious. Looks like it. I have brought a letter from His Highness, Yoder. A secret note from the Imperial Candidate, huh? Read it aloud. If Don Whitehorse is taken out of the picture, we are willing to overlook the Union's responsibility in the Barbos affair. What? What? <laughs> Don't make me laugh. Is that really what it's saying in there? What? What is this? Looks like you and the young master see things a bit differently. There must be some mistake. Master Yoder would never say such a thing. Show our guest here to his own private suite. Don Whitehorse, please listen to me. This is some sort of trap. What if the blood aligns is behind that as well? Flynn! Why would you... Hang on. If we screw up, it'll only make things worse for Flynn. <gasps> All out war with the Empire. We'll take everything we've got and march on the Imperial capital. Oh, that's a little bit much, isn't it? Try and make a fool out of me, and I'll tear these little messengers limb from limb! Not gonna say anything to us? Okay. Th this is bad! And it looks like he's forgotten all about talking with us. Yeah, it seems to have what I don't think that Don's in much of a talking mood right now. I have to return to the Empire and find out what's really going on. I said hang on. We should sit still for now and see what happens. 
I... I suppose you're right. Raven left the party. The conspiracy and Flynn's in trouble. I cannot believe that Yoder would give a letter like that to Flynn. There must be some mistake. We've met His Highness too, and he certainly didn't seem like that kind of person. But you heard the letter! It said to take Don Whitehorse out of the picture! So maybe it was sent by someone who wants to throw a wrench into what Yoder and Flynn are doing. But that's nothing more than a hunch right now. Yeah, you're right. The only thing we know for sure right now is that Flynn is in trouble. Seems really weird. Fishy and fishy and fishy. The most fishy thing there is. The dungeon is up ahead. There's a knight held captive there right now. No one is allowed to enter beyond this point. I wonder if war will break out against the Empire. My mother lives in Zafias. I'm reluctant to fight in the war against the country where my mother lives. Mm, I don't need a weakling like you. I still don't need a weakling like me. We've got the Dawn on our side. The Empire's finished. The Dawn holds the reins with a strong grip. We too can become dauntless warriors. I did my... This... Uh, hello? There we go. Yet. The fuck? There we go. Let me refresh that. Still running properly. Yeah, it's still running properly. It was just weird. Okay. <sighs> the Empire is supposedly going to attack when you tighten up security. We need to tighten up security. Oh. Huh, that's strange. What's the matter, Yuri? It looks like I dropped my wallet somewhere. At a time like this? Maybe it fell out of my pocket at the Don's place. I'm gonna go look. You wait here. Uh, okay. Don't take too long. Alright, I had to go see how Flynn's holding up. Yeah, out of everyone. I don't kill people willingly. It's not about morals or taking lives, it's just my policy. Whatever, I gotta pay the Empire back. I'm gonna have some fun. We'll stick with the Dawn to do to the end, and we'll Dawn find his armor to do it. <laughs> You guys want to join us? Not really. Can we get further here or is it gonna stop me? No, it isn't. The knight who came here acting all tough is in prison. Serves him right. Gotta stock up on all sorts of stuff before the Empire attacks. Those Empire types better underestimate us. We'll never lose to the Empire. Hey Yuri, do you find your wallet? Wimper. Talk to her. Yo, buddy, you sure you ain't an Empire spy, huh? Well, you got a problem, buddy. Step right up, feast your eyes on these wares. You can't buy stuff like this in the Empire. Come one, come all, feast your eyes on these wares. What can I do to save Flynn? Even if the Empire attacks, so don't beat him up good. Going to help the Don if I don't fight him. Say, did you hear the cool knight got arrested? Kind of a shame, he looked so cool. What the? Guilds are worthless. What are the. Oh, okay. We can go here and prepare. Probably have a fight to go through. If I would have guessed. Do the safe here. There we go. Could rest at the end, theoretically, if we wanted to. But there's probably nothing else we need right now. Can't go to the tavern, can we? The Empire, the Knights, nobody in this town trusts them at all. 
Imperial Council and the Knights wouldn't stand a chance if the guilds bundled together to take them on. Still locked, okay. I was thinking of going to the Union Jail for a little bit. I want to go laugh at a night day card. The night dragged people into jail and now he's in jail himself. <laughs> but he's not laughing now. Of course they're angry here. The stand was built by people wronged by the Empire. So we are of the monster attack. That doesn't change the fact that monsters still exist. We know we know that, okay. Check out the tavern here. Trying to fight with the Imperial Knights or not? That is the question. I really don't wanna go. What would be best if it all ended while I'm thinking about it again? <laughs> Oh, the situation with the knights is about to blow up. Just let me eat in peace. How oh, about when I'm done eating? Just wait a sec. Even our mighty barrier won't protect us against the Imperial Knights. If only we had a barrier that worked against people. Sometimes the solidarity of the guilds can be a painful thing. People with conviction who get bound by the rules can often go crazy. And now can do crazy things. That's a little bit different. <laughs> There's a long history of hospi hostility between the Empire and the guilds. I might not be, it might not be too bad to finally sell things. On the surface, they make it seem like a cold war, but they really just slipped into a stalemate. Oh. Any specials? Oh yeah, that stuff. And the owner here, can I get you anything? I'll try anything on part-timer. A little to-do with the Empire isn't enough to shake me, that's the way it's always been. Just living in this town makes your heart strong. The Empire and the Union are going head to head? No good, no good. Is there anything I can do? I guess not. I don't care about the fight between the Empire and the Guilds. I'm head over heels for this waitress. Have you heard? The barrier was fixed. Oh, you already knew that. No matter how much the Empire may struggle, they don't match it done. He's the strongest man I know, next to me, of course. If you say so. Anything new here? Not really. A war is never a good thing, that's for sure. Alrighty, so we uh, explore all of that. I kind of want to go to the Gourmet area again as well. Hey, the Empire's gonna attack, but it's still got an equipment. We know that much. Now we can finally take on those idiots from the Empire. We'll show them a thing or two. I think there's nothing updated, is there? Human Knox, that's where we come in. That's unskilled. Well, well, what do we do? We'll be in danger if they find out we're nobles. Are we going to be okay? They'll beat us up if they find out we're nobles. I don't know. You say the Empire is coming to attack? Well, well, it's not very peaceful at all, is it? Mm, yeah, so there's nothing else going on here. Then let us make our way towards the prison. The Empire is supposedly going to attack. We need to tighten up security. They don't have anything against us so far. That's good. We have to down on our side. The Empire is finished. Oh, now we can go here. That's cool. Nobody around here. Nice, Flynn. Yuri. Thought I was being quiet, but I guess you heard me. So, you've come to have a laugh at me in this sorry state? Yeah, I wanted to see what kind of expression being locked up put on your face. 
It doesn't hurt to be forced to view things from behind bars every now and then. What the hell you think you were doing, coming here with a letter like that? That was the Red Eyes doing. They attacked after you left. You don't screw up like that. Was it one of your people? Even if it was, the responsibility is mine. I see. If the Red Eyes are involved, then Rago's gotta be behind it all. But how do you know? At the harbor, we saw Rago giving orders to one of their assassins. I hadn't heard about that. Do you know what they're trying to do? Most likely, they want to force a clash between the guilds and the knights. That'd be... bad. You think another one of those false letters went to the knights? Yes, to put them in a fighting mood. If you know that much, then get out there and get the real letters back. I was wondering how long it'd take you to get rid of that damn lock. <laughs> You've got to stay here. What, and be your scapegoat? You're just itching to get rid of me, aren't you? Yuri, if I don't make it back, you'll have to die in my place. Yeah. Okay, are we now in prison? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Taking your friend's place in a jail cell? You lost your mind, son? This coming from an old man who gets rid of his own guards on purpose. <laughs> hmm. I had a special favor to ask that rookie knight. You mean Flynn? The rats that plan these sort of stunts usually like to enjoy their handiwork from somewhere nearby. If you knew the letter was fake, why'd you fire everyone up like that? If I didn't make a good show of things, whoever's behind all this wouldn't bother to come watch. Besides, we've got a lot of hotheads around here who'd never let me hear the end of it if I didn't raise hell. So that's where it stands. Of course, if our friend the knight doesn't show up again, your life is mine. I know. Tell me one thing, though. What made you want to start a guild in the first place? I realized I couldn't protect the things that were important to me playing by the Empire's rules. There have to be some things that were easier to protect when you're on the other side, though. Even in the lower quarter where I'm from, we still had the barrier to protect us. Sure. But were you happy with just putting up with all the things you didn't like? Well, I... So if the rules the Empire sets don't suit you, you got two choices. You can do like your friend is, and put everything you've got to change in the system. Or, you can turn your back on the Empire, and live by the rules you set for yourself. That's pretty clear cut. Yep. I think you're gonna have to take responsibility for letting my prisoner go. You want me to do something besides rotting in this cell? The sap who's been putting together this little show has got to be somewhere in this city. Oh, I've been planning on asking your armor-wearing friend to hunt him down for me, but... So what? You want me to find them? Your job is to pay this debt back to me. How you go about it is up to you. All right. That young lady you brought with you is running all over the place helping with the injured folks. You're not the type to be the only one sitting around twiddling its thumbs, right? Estelle. Huh. <laughs> that sounds like her. Okay, that was an interesting transition. Yeah, yeah, only me be okay. That's long, and probably won't open, that's fine. Chest, or did I imagine that? I imagined that, okay. I wonder who's behind it all. All will break out, we already know that. A weakling like you, okay. Private rooms. Got a doll on our side, we know that much. We know that much as well. I would guess we go to the tavern now. Oh. Out of the way! The dawn is passing through! Is he really planning on going to war just to lure those rats out of hiding? 
We'll teach those Imperial bastards to look down on us! Oh, Yuri! Have you finished healing the injured yet? How did you know that? The Don told me. This is from him, his way of saying thanks. But Yuri, things have gotten really bad! Yeah, I noticed. No, that's not what I mean! What else? I saw them! Them? You saw who? The Blood Alliance. Barbos wasn't with them, but... Rita and Repeat are shadowing them right now! Just what the Dawn wanted. Let's catch up with Rita! Yeah. Reunite with Zell and Carol. Okay. What the Dawn and Flynn are thinking. Where were you talking with the Dawn, Yuri? You were gone for a long time. We had a nice little chat through some thick iron bars. Yuri, did you get Flynn out of prison by trading places with him? No, it's nothing like that. Flynn would have been released even if I hadn't gotten involved. What do you mean? The Dawn planned all along to capture Flynn and use him to find out who's behind this whole mess. So both the Dawn and Flynn know that there's someone else manipulating things? Yeah. Why do I keep letting myself get caught up in this stuff? Now the Dawn's making me do his dirty work. What a pain. Well, that's how it goes. We know that. We know that as well. Oh, there's Rita. Okay. I thought we would go there. Rita. Yes! Let's go inside. But if Barbos is in there... Then we can't just sit around and watch either, huh? What should we do? Let me give you a tip. Oh, it's you again. Hey, hey, is it okay you being here? No, it ain't okay. But the Don asked me to make sure you youngsters don't screw things up. Why don't you guys come with me to a tavern and hear what I got to say? We don't have the time to... Aw, oh, come on! You sound like you think I'm gonna trick you! Well, you have tricked us before! I can handle getting tricked a couple times. But there are limits to my patience, old man. What's with the grim face? I get it. All right. Come now, kids. Show me those pearly whites. All right, this way. So we go to the other tavern first. Unite with read and repeat. Um, let's get my default party back up and running. Repeat. Don't repeat, Rita, Rita goes here, there we go. Hey, hold on a sec, getting close and that guard's gonna see ya. Are you listening? We better make sure this isn't some trick of his before we barge head first into a danger zone. Well then, how about we make that bar over there? Yeah, sure, why not? The Don plugging this area, or is that... that fine? Okay. Stop right up, okay. So no, they don't have anything new to say to us. Don't do save, obviously. I know everything is alright. Certainly gonna go into a fight, most likely. Union Jail, okay. Let's go to Tavern. What now? We're coming through. Who's that knight? What is this place? Just a place that Don has for drinking with important guests and having secret conversations. Are you telling us just to stay here and drink? If your friend comes back with the real letter, things could be settled peacefully. Sorry, but I can't let Flynn hog all the glory. We need to find the criminal behind all of this trouble. If that happens to be Barbos... Easy now. Haste makes waste. 
for the secret door. What's this? There are sewer tunnels that sprawl in a labyrinth beneath this town. Long ago, when the town was occupied by the Empire, the guilds used these tunnels to fight back. Wait! Don't tell me this place is connected to those sewer tunnels! That's exactly what it is. And our plan is to use them to sneak right up behind those guys. Quickly sneak in and catch them, huh? It's a bit of a detour, but it's the best chance we got. That's the idea. Aren't you glad you trusted me? I won't know that until it's all over. So, you still don't trust me, huh? Naturally, you'll be coming with us too, right, old man? Aw, oh, crap! And I was totally planning on skipping town. I'm saying we want to share the glory with you, old man. Come on, let's go. <laughs> he ain't amused to even join the party. Alrighty. I guess we're going through a door. I didn't even notice that before. I thought it was just a normal wall. Oh, it's pitch black. Indeed it is. I'd rather not get lost in here and never see the light of day again. Yo, genius mage girl, can you use some fire magic and light up this place? Are you trying to use me as your personal lamp? You've got some nerve, old man. Rita, isn't there something you can do? Hmm, nope. Fire magic is only used for combat. For us to have continuous illumination, air would need to be constantly supplied. Like Lux Blastia. Huh, really? You weren't counting on that, were you, old man? <laughs> hmm. Is this a Blastia? It's seriously damaged, but I think we can use it. Okay. Whoa! Isn't that thing gonna explode? Are we okay? Of course it's not gonna explode. This is a type of Lux Blastia. It uses that device to charge air and light up. I knew you could do it, Rita. But it's on its last leg, so I don't think it'll last too long. Let's get moving while we've still got light. Lux Blast, a portable light source found by repeat. Keep it full of air to continue using it. Calm down, old man. <coughs> What's up, pupper? You need something? It's dark, so you'll get lost if you stray too far. Thanks for worrying about me, lass, but I'll be fine. It's so dank in here. I hope we don't have to stay too long. It may be dank, but at least the bustle is gone. I prefer the quiet of these tunnels. Uh, right. I'll never be able to keep up with your sensitivities. <laughs> oh, repeat. Do you know where Raven went? Hey, Poochie. Where'd you... Ugh. Ow! Ah. There goes the quiet you were talking about. Yes, well... I've become accustomed to it. Stop jabbering about customs and help an old man out. I think this is actually old kind of things. Oh, so it's connected to our sorcerer's ring. We obtained 3,000 guard, that's cool. Monsters! Um, they won't attack us, will they? We shouldn't have anything to worry about. <sighs> the light. We need to charge up some air before it goes out. What the? <laughs> and what is that? Some kind of fishman and other fishman things. Magic lands, albino merfish, and a widigal. Widigal. We're gonna use another magic lens on this guy. Another albino merfish. can still cook, but we can't cook fried chicken or beef bowl. Might want to look in different recipes. Uh, sure, mine's friend soup. That was scary! 
sorry. I never expected monsters to wait for us to drop our guard before an attack. There's no way any monster is that smart. Perhaps they're weak against light or something? There are monsters like that? There are indeed. Creatures that live in dark places such as caverns in the ocean floor sometimes have an aversion for light and work hard to avoid it. Oh, right. So that's why they didn't attack when it was bright. Oh, there's another one of those machines. Alrighty. Oh, how interesting. So we just need to be careful to recharge the lamp before it runs out of juice. Alrighty. Um, I wanted to look at cooking. What can we have? Can't do beef bowl right now. Can we move that and fried chicken? What are we gonna do? Carol is our cook now. So uh, I'm gonna add pudding. What's the sorbet need? I don't even know. Apparently we can create sorbet as well. That's some cake. And for my sake, sorbet. There we go. I don't even know what that needs. Egg and milk. So it's... So it's no use to use pudding or sorbet. Because I need them anyway, so let's move pudding and salt bed. I guess we had rice bowl and sandwich then. That's fine. Okay. So we have a light source now. That's fine. We can replenish air all the time, but we can also fight enemies. Blast him all. That's cool. Oh wow, a free attack. Lots of flyers. Red eyed bat. Okay. A magic lantern. 1000 health. Let me go in over limit for that one then. I don't even know. Oh god. Okay, we got one of them down. Oh, I switched my arts, didn't I? Yeah, I switched to Azure Edge. I want to go back to Dragon Swarm. Going to overlimit again. All right, that will work out. 30% TP, uh, max HP and max TP, but this doesn't really work. I think it's 15 and not 15% for a rice ball. Oh, that's another one of these. Guess you can't really uh, easily fight those guys. Can you stop pummeling me? We finished them off. I finished them off. Huh? In a sandwich. I think it's 10 and not 10%, at least it looks that way to me. To so plunge the air, sure. Getting used up pretty quickly, to be honest. Thank you. 
All right. A battle guard? Is that useful for anybody like you? You have already a battle guard. Is anybody else using guards? You already have one as well. Okay. I'm using fine boots. Alright. What is that away? Some writings on the wall. Hmm, there's something carved here. Words? What is this? Long ago, our ancestors abandoned their nations for forgetting their duty to protect their people, and thus became the true defenders of freedom. That is how the guilds first began. But now, the iron shackles of oppression threaten to strangle us once again. It is because we have forgotten the oath of our ancestors, and spent our time fighting one another for our own self-interests. Therefore, we must once again return to the basic principles behind the guilds, and join our strengths together as one. Okay, uh, like the Union. We offer our swords for freedom, our shields for friendship, and our lives for the common good. Here we renew our ancient oath. Hey! Isn't that the Union Oath? What is that? It's like a slogan that the Dawn came up with when he formed the Union. We can't depend on the Empire, so we have to protect each other. In order to do that, we need to join forces and put our lives on the line for one another. But what's the Oath doing in a place like this? The Union is based on the guilds that resisted when this town was occupied by the Empire. Before that, guilds just did whatever they wanted and only joined together when there was a problem. Once things were resolved, they split up again. But with the Empire's occupation, they changed that. So the guy who led those guild forces was Don Whitehorse? Yep. These sewer tunnels must have really come in handy back then. So that's when they made the oath here? Probably. Looks kind of old. Seems that way. I'd heard there was an actual written oath, but I had no idea it'd be etched in a wall like this. There's something beautiful about how the oath is written on a wall. It says, I freed right here. I freed, okay. Oh yeah, that infamous king of the pirates. The way Don tells it, he was supposedly a sworn ally. But he was such a shrewd and cunning individual that even the Don had difficulty dealing with him. The Don's a pretty impressive guy to be able to call someone like that a sworn ally. Our lives for the common good, huh? I'm glad I got to see something so fascinating. But we take care of Barbos now. Let's go. The Union Oath. Our swords for freedom, huh? The Union Oath, right? Fighting for personal freedom instead of draconian imperial law sounds good to me. If you feel that way, maybe the guilds are right. Why is the audio quality so bad? Yeah, I wasn't cut out to be a knight. <laughs> huh? You agree, Rapide? <laughs> the guilds, huh? Long ago, our ancestors abandoned their nations for forgetting their duty to protect their people, and thus became the true defenders of freedom. That is how the guilds first began, but now the iron shackles of oppression threaten to strangle us once again. It is because we have forgotten the oath of our ancestors, and spent our time fighting one other for our own self-interests. Therefore, we must once again return to the basic principles behind the guilds and join our strength. Together as one, we offer our swords for freedom, our shields for friendship, and our lives for the common good. Here, we renew our ancient oath. Okay. I don't know why the sound quality for the skit suddenly decreases like that. I'm so weird. What? I guess it is replenished already. Uh, we can go loud, we can go this way. Got some breastlights here. 
That's fine. Oh my god, that's like a labyrinth, isn't it? Of course it is. Grab that one. What? Don't get sloppy. That's great. Ow! They hurt, like, really hard. Wow, she's already out of TP. How is that possible? I got a little worked up. He wants some cake now. And he failed to cook cake. Wonderful. But Carol will be out cooking a party now. Totally did replenish that, so I don't know why. That happened. All the proof cloth. That's good. God, everything is like dead end around here. I hate kind of labyrinths. That's not good. Well, we've got a safe point here, so I guess I found the right way. What that means is we're gonna have bag. Oh god, that's not good. There's a chest right here. God damn, they always attack from behind. That's not great. God! Oh my god. Why are they so hard and damaging me? They do a lot of damage, Jesus. Ow, ow! Change style, he learned that. The red lens, whatever red lens is useful. Lens equipped by members of the Leviathan Claw. What do you see with that? I don't know. Oh god, why does it always count as a back attack? It's annoying. Oh god, why are there so many? Way too strong. I'm glad we're still alive. Well, yeah. Stop. Wind blade. Stop. 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 Hey, that was a nice break from things. Thanks. Get some salmons from those. Where do we need to go? Here, maybe? Oh, he went this way, okay, so we want to go and replenish that first. And then we'd be going the other way. Oh, 
And that away. The chest, wonderful. We obtained 4,000 gold. Okay, that leads to nowhere and that leads to the beginning. Okay, we pretty much got all of that done. That might be bad. Oh no, we got through it. Alright. And there's another chest here. 6,000 gold, Jesus. We get like a million gold. Just loop around theoretically. Oh, wait, why is there? Okay. Guess it's a dead end. Did I go this way already? I did, okay. Oh, that's not good. Uh, where do we go? Why does that count as a back attack? It makes no we'll sense. It makes absolutely no sense, actually. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, go in Super Saiyan mode. Alright, now we got him. Next week. Thank you, thank you. Land of Wait, she got a level up already. Nowhere to go. That way. Oh god, oh god, oh god. I won't lose. Surprise encounter with counter link. Lovely. At least we can backstab now. Don't over the match, there we go. Oh, that's annoying. Okay, only one left. We finished them off. I finished them off. Huh? Like a rice ball going, fell at that. That's fine. We get a lot of bad wings and some onions apparently. For some reason. Replenish that. We can interact with that and save. I guess we're up to the next boss now. From the looks of it. At least we got a save point right here. Where are we? A tavern in the eastern part of town used by Barbos as a hideout. Basically, it's the place you guys were trying to sneak into. Then Barbos is somewhere around here? Looks like there's a second floor. Let's see what's up there. Oops, those guild numbers are still outside, huh? What's that? The store is self-service. Go up to the counter to order. Oh, what, what was that? There's a name on this. Sa? Sakuraba? 
don't know. Who knows? Oh, that's outside. Guild members against knights. They're going on it, apparently. Oh, those only knights. Who's that? Barbos, what is the meaning of this? Oh. That's Barbos, okay. I haven't the slightest idea what you're talking about. The Tower and the Blastia, of course. I have yet to receive any reports about them. Why should I have to report to you about something like that? What? Building that lousy tower fortress of yours without speaking a word of it to your own employer? Oh, yeah, I already saw the tower. You even went so far as to use Leviathan's Claw for help! Leviathan's Claw? What is that? I'm not your lapdog, Rago. I just gathered the cores together, like you requested. It's thanks to my efforts that you were able to make that weather-controlling Blastia. And just what made you think it was okay to carry off the extra cores? Our mutual non-interference was a condition of our agreement, was it not? What? And did I ever interfere with what you were doing? Barbos, how dare you! You will leave now, Magistrate. Remember this, Barbos. Black-hearted filth like you always get what they deserve in the end. And what about you, Rago? You wanna talk, Rago? You guys! It's the World Series of Villains, and you had to take the best seat in the house? What fool would dare to heckle my exquisite performance? Oh, -ho! if it isn't the little runts I met on the ship. You're the one who's been causing all of the recent chaos. And what of it? You fools will never manage to capture me. Oh, yeah? What's your reasoning there? A villain is someone who never considers losing a possibility. That's why he thinks the way he does. If so, then that makes you quite a villain, Yuri. Yep, I'm nefarious. <sighs> so we're rebelling, huh? You're a real troublemaker, you know that? You've got a big mouth, brat. All right. You would dare to oppose me? I thought I told you before that next time you wouldn't get off so easy. All the better for us to tear things up. Take them down! What is that? Ha <laughs> ha! The fools have started to march! Now that meddlesome Don and the Knights will destroy each other! He did this to destroy the Union and to eliminate the Dawn! If the Knights are destroyed, who will protect the Empire? Rago, why would you... Oh... Of course! He's gonna weaken the Imperial Knights so that the Council can step in and control the Empire! And he's gonna use the Blood Alliance to seize Altosk and rule over the Union. Oh my! The Knights and the Union going down together. It's just as Flynn said. <laughs> so what if you know now? No matter what you do, you won't be able to stop the battle! Huh, we'll see. And your existence comes to an end here! Where did my healer go? Damn it, he's too late! Dad Flynn. Flynn! Stop! All of you! Sheath your blades! Sheath them! I am Flynn Shifo of the Imperial Knights. I have come bearing a letter from Master Yoder. The letter you received from the Empire was false. It was the work of a rebel. Draw back your armies at once. I thought you weren't coming back. And leave Yuri behind to take the fall for me? I wouldn't dream of it. <laughs> nice. Rego, you fool! You didn't keep up your end of the bargain. Don't hurt me! Damn! Yuri! They're aiming at Flynn! Got oh, him! Nice. 
Good work, Carol. Nice shot, Carol. You brats think you can stop me? You have a friggin' laser gun, or what's that? Get out of here! Head for the exit! Oh, is that a one on one? Yuri, no, it's too dangerous! It should take time for the air to recharge. I'll try and stop him before then. Now! You're too late! No! It charged up too quickly! Oh. The, the dragon what rider. The hell? What in the world is that? Oh, so you're back for more, Dragon Freak? Rita, knock it off. Our enemy's over there. My enemy is this Dragon Freak. Oh, God damn it, Rita. Stop that shit. Leave it alone for now. Hmm. I'm gonna make you wish you hadn't done that. That's an interesting sword you got there. It's like half chainsaw. What? He can fly? Oh, so the boss is heading for the hills, huh? Oh, get back here, you freak! Think I'm just gonna let you get away? If you're going after him, let me come with you. We're a little short on wings around here. Are you crazy? This jerk's our enemy! No matter what happens, I've got to catch that guy. Come on! There's a spear. It might be a yes. she, I don't know. Thanks. Are we leaving the party behind? Wait! What about us? This guy is overloaded enough as it is. But what should we... You guys hold down the fort here. What? Stay out of trouble. Damn it, Yuri! And let Flynn know I'm stepping out for a while. Okay, we parted with everyone. Great. And we get a cinematic go. No, righty. A little bit of a storm brewing. And now we're alone, are we? Well, isn't that great? The Tower of Gears, Gears for Roast. Okay, Gears for Roast. Or Gears Farrest. Oh, you want to pronounce so that? Was his doing. Oh, are we going into a one on one? You. You've destroyed the Blastia! I kinda wanna heal if I'm gonna fight against them. Hey, How? Are you okay? Oh. Bastards. Dragon's still alive at least. We're just getting started. Ha! My men won't have any trouble taking care of a brat like you. Now rip him to pieces! Um, are we doing a one on four? A one on six? Are you fucking kidding me? A one on nine? Wait, what? Um... Are you joking? You're joking with me, right? There's no way I can beat him.
Let me go and put Azure Edge on here. Ow! Ow! That hurts! Stop it. Well, they're actually not too bad, aren't they? Oh my god! Okay, they, I take it back. They are actually really bad. It's so hard to move even a little bit. What is the weakened one? It's this guy. Ow! Ow! I can't move! Why do you stop me from moving like that? There are like 10 million people around here. Just the problem. Okay, if we use now an apple gel on us. Why am I not targeting the right guy for that? Holy shit. There's just so many of them. Oh my god. Every time I'm attacking, I'm getting vulnerable as well. You get a little bit away from them. Ow, 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 ow. Stop that. Not nice. Or right, apple shell, please. Oh, god damn you. Holy shit, this is so ridiculous. Okay, we got the first one down for the count. Who's next? I guess this guy. I, it's a little bit of a cheesy way to do this, but I can't really do it any other way, to be honest. Oh my god, please let me uh, walk. see an opening right now. Just unfortunate. Because they're all over the place. Okay, that might be an opening I could use. There we go. But I'm only going to do that. I can't imagine we have to do this on our own all the time, but... Jesus Christ. Oh, do you see that? That's like <laughs> insane. Makes absolutely no sense why they're able to do that that way. Oh, we could get an opening here for the apple gel. Ow, stop that. Jesus Christ, they are annoying. Okay, okay, we got another one down for the count, that's good. 7,000... I don't know how much that is, something with 900. 
5200, that looks about right. Ow, 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 not good, not good, not good. We need to go through here. There we go. We're getting them slowly but surely. Can you please stop that? Do is use another apple gel here. There we go. Okay, we got another one down. 5,900. You're next. Okay, he's starting to run from me, so... Might as well take the as next one. Ow, 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 not good, not good at all. We could go into Overlimit, theoretically. But for that, I'm gonna use a Melon's Gel if we have one. Ah, uh, might as well use a Lemon Gel here. 1,000, there's one, this one is only 2,000 now. There we go. There we go. We got him down. It took a while, but we got him eventually. Ooh, that was difficult. You want revenge? Bring it. Oh, well, we have nobody who can cook right now. Is that all you got? Looks like I'm gonna have to teach you your place. Huh, that's a handy sword you've got. Think you lost because of this sword, huh? I don't know. What do you think? Yeah, talk it up while you've got the chance. We've got a nice, painful death all set up for you. And now? Am I in prison? Or something similar? What's the case? Now I defeated shut up them. For a while. What's the deal? Please, I've got to get out of here. It's always something with you, isn't it, old man? It's not polite to point sharp objects at your elders. Yeah! That was interesting. Hey! Oh, that's the one guy or girl, Dragon Rider. That's enough. Damn it. A woman. Oh, it's a girl. And she's okay. Christian. It's an elf. Are you all right? <laughs> Sorry. Well, after all, you did help Baul back there. Baul, is that a dragon? Baul. Yes, my friend. Oh, you mean that monster? So tell me, what are you going around destroying Blastia for? <sighs> not a big deal if you don't feel like talking about it. I'm afraid it's not as impressive as you might think. 
I'm destroying them because I want to. You're right. I'm not all that impressed. So that's why you mashed up Barbos's Blastia, too. Yes, but I didn't finish the job. And can you just let this one go? There wouldn't be any fun in destroying something like that. Huh. Okay. Hey, I'm not why don't we work off. together a little longer? Hmm. It's true, I wasn't able to finish off the Blastia on the roof. Okay, then. So what do we do? Hmm, there is one way I was thinking we could get out of here. Well, if you think it might work, what's the harm in trying it out? I always say, those who can, should. Okay, just go along with me on this. I'll just follow your lead. <laughs> Don't worry. It's a little nerve-wracking working with a pretty lady, though. Ah! Oh, that is it! Ah! Pipe down! Cut it out! You cut it out! I said that's enough! I've had it up to here with you! Somebody get me away from this psycho! So I'm gonna have to teach you a lesson, huh? Ah, nice. Thanks for opening the door. <laughs> That's that. That's interesting. Okay, that's one way to do it. Just pretending a fight. You're free. Thanks for your help. I think I still owe you one more. Huh? Guess I uh, overdid it back there. There. That makes us even. I'm Yuri. Yuri Lowell. Judith. Judith. Okay. Judith. Uh, Judy's easier to say. Fine by me. All right, on to the next objective. Next? Well, we could check out the Blasty on the roof. All we have to do is go up. Won't your friends be waiting for you? I don't mind taking care of the Blasty first. Up we go, then. And how exactly do we go up? This is heavy. Yeah, just go wander off. Reminds me of a certain princess. <laughs> princess? Never mind. There's got to be a way up around here somewhere. Let's see what we can find. Judith joined the party. Judith Zama. Hey, why were you wearing that stuffy-looking suit of armor? Oh, you didn't like it? It's pretty sturdy and protects my body quite nicely. See? Look at this beautiful skin free of bruises and blemishes. Very nice. I'm actually worried where my eyes might wander. <laughs> you don't look all that worried to me. I've just got a good poker face. So you're okay? You don't mind leaving your armor behind? It's sturdy, but it's heavy. Walking around with that on tires me out. Hey, no complaints here. I prefer eye candy to scary armor any day. <laughs> All right, can I not go into the into the options? Oh, we don't have uh, equipment. That might explain stuff. Can we go back? Can go back, apparently. The guard is knocked out. He won't wake up anytime soon. Alrighty. And we have a safe point here. Couldn't we just take a sword from them? Oh, there's some chests. My chests. All my chests. I saw them right here. Melange gel and life bottle. They get rid of all my equipment. Can go here apparently. Nice. Specific times one. Magic lenses times three. Okay. We obviously are supposed to interact with that thing. No, we are not. Okay.
can exit this place from here. Okay. Can enter that area. Oh. It looks like we can't go any higher, and we can't go outside either. What's the matter? My spear is gone. Things might be difficult without a weapon. Hmm. What the? Is the sorcerer's ring broken? Did the air here do this? Hey, you're more fashion conscious than I thought. This isn't fashion. You go like this, and... Oh. It moved. It's powered up. I'll bet you could move other levers with that, too. You think it's okay? I'm afraid it might blow up or something. If it happens, it happens. For now, let's pull that lever over there. If something this tiny exploded, I guess it wouldn't be too dangerous. Unless it's exploded on your finger and rip off your finger. It's also a ring level 2, a mysterious ring that can shoot air and capable of making physical impact. Strong bonds. Was that fancy ring a present from someone? Hmm, I guess you could call it a present. Well, well, looks like you're quite the ladies' man. No, 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 I'm just a big sucker. Oh? It's amazing enough the ring holds power, but it even reacts to air and becomes stronger. You must have a very strong bond with the girl who gave that to you. And that's one bond I wouldn't mind breaking. It was Rita who gave that to me, isn't it? Okay, this is my weapon. Here we got his weapon back. Can't find yours? Someone might have just took it. Maybe. Why don't you just pick one here? Uh, right. Was that something special for you? Yes, it was. Well, this should do for a while. I'll take this. Are you fine with that? I don't think I will find my weapon here. I'll look for it as I go on. I'll try looking for it too. Thank you. You'd have obtained a spear. And we got a pineapple jar. Anything else to interact with? Okay, we can... Let's run around with Judith, why not? Does she have, like, spells to heal? No, she doesn't. At least not from the looks of it. Wall pike, some boots, silver circlet. Keeps decent enough. Trench coat. Um... Another cape. Fine boots. Guess fine boots will work for now. Do we have any special items? Compact sword, stuff like that. Nothing too special. Okay. It's not from the outside, this can't be used as an exit, okay. Who are you? Bendor Stall Mallow. Thanks a lot, you even got my stuff back. Wanna buy something? Okay, that was random, but okay. Take the onion, and the strawberries, and the rice, and the bread, and the max, and the milk. Um, do have anything else? No, only of those things. We can buy five of them, just stock, or stock up with them. Synthesis. Anything for you. Rival Edge, Oka, Raven, nothing on right now from the looks of it. Everything seems like a decrease at the moment. Oh. The other coat is better though. Could make one of them. Sure. Why not? Uh, since we don't sell stuff, we can synthesize it. Thieves cape. Anything here? Anything special? No. Alrighty, let's go to equipment. Other coat and Thieves cape. Oh yeah, I want to sell something as well. Way over here. Summon... Tomatoes. Well, that's about it, okay. Then we want to change to cooking. 
Um, Yuri, Yuri, uh, rice ball, sure. Egg. Sandwich, if at all possible, yeah. Alrighty. Yuri is back on cooking duty. So we can use that as well. Nice. We could walk upstairs. You're pretty strong. Can you use an overlimit by any chance? Of course. Sure, yeah. Okay, then try this. Huh? What's this? The limit duo. Limit duo. Your battle spirit can allow you to use even more powerful overlimits. Okay. Oh yeah? If your battle spirit is the real thing, that is. So what else can you tell me about these strong overlimits? You can produce more power when attacking alone. Is that so? I still don't quite get it. Really? Maybe you'll pick it up as you use them in battle. Sounds good to me. All right, let's get moving then. Limit duo, look into the orb to receive its powers. It enhances open limits. A new page has been added to the battle book. All right, let's have a look at the battle book then. I've been there for a while. Oh, level 2 Overlimit. You can trigger a level 2 Overlimit when an Overlimit gauge reaches the second level. Use the direction to use one bar of the gauge. You see, oh, okay. Right is one bar, up is two bars. Or left and down. In addition to a level 1 attack, a level 2 Overlimit will inflict additional damage on a foreign enemy. Overlimit and skill symbols. When two characters go into overlimit at the same time, both characters can gain the effects of the other's skill symbol on top of their own. For instance, if one has the skill symbol flag on the out and the other strim, both characters' attack power and speed will increase when they go into overlimit at the same time. How can I get people into overlimit at the same time? How is it even possible? I don't know. Okay, so that is one way to go up. Is there another way somewhere, maybe? Is that it? Over here. Nothing in there. Maybe we could go down. I wanted to use that. Oh. I can't go down from the looks of it. I would need to reverse the facts. I totally would need to reverse the effects, okay. So the only thing we can do right now is go up anyway. Alright, we got him. They're wide open! It's nothing personal. We got Badindo and another Badido. Okay. Oh yeah, we need to change Azure Edge with uh, Dragon Swan again. Not that. Can you please? A healer would be really great, you know. Right about now. We're done. So I gotta take like some sandwich. There we go. This power will make me stronger. Ash and moonlight. And Tidal Great Lancer. Let's give her the Tidal Great Lancer then. I'm not sure if that makes any difference. Blastia Hunter. A girl who travels the world to destroy Blastias. Yuri is the only one that knows her secret. You'll fight to the death to defend your cause. You always follow through with your goals. You set out to strike down on the earth once again with determination and conviction. Fine, alright. 
access is that away. We could access that away. Exit that away. There we go. Crescent axe. An axe with a crescent blade. The sharp, thick blade is effective against heavily armored enemies. Okay. New thing. Reflect and roll. I'm gonna equip it just to learn everything. I need magic. I'm not gonna use the critical guard much, so. Get a strength of two up in this case, though. Increases damage taken by uh, half when staggering, okay. Able to cancel action of a backstab upon landing, can also backstab repeatedly. Might as well, you don't have anything special. Oh, you do. You do have some stuff already. Okay. Well, that's fine, I guess. Damn it. Came out of the thing. Is this a big and the soldier? Magic Lensum. A thousand. Magic Lens, the other ones as well. Need to go in over limit now. Oh god, that is really bad actually. I hate to rely on items. I would like to have a healer pretty soon. Please, Estelle, come back to me. For being so strong. Oh, chicken, demon bone. Not much. It's gonna get ugly. Looks like a birdie over here. Can we? Why can't I hit the birdie? Oh man! All right, all right. Okay, what is that guy? A gear golem. I need to go and over limit. Ow, 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 ow. This is really, really bad and annoying. Jesus Christ. Damn it, that's really hard without a healer. Get some cake going, alrighty. Holy shit, this is insane actually. Jack, orange gel, fine by me. But holy shit, I'm ne I need to use apple gels all out of a zoo. There we go. Not one of these guys. Guess we can do this. Well, those, those are like some horse raptors. Oh, those are the horse raptors. You need to go and over them immediately. Oh 
All right, do I need a robot that's left? Alrighty. We're done. Need some more cake. One more cake. I need more apple jelly. I need pretty much more everything. We could enter here. Okay. Wait, what? I thought I was able to move the chest for a minute here. Battle suit. I don't think she can wear that, can she? Yeah. She wears garments. We could exit through here. And we could probably use that one. And we can enter here. What's around here? Anything nice? Leather coat. I already made that one now. But all that was here. Okay. Of course those skies respawns now. Oh my god. Man, could you be any weaker? I guess I'll go easy on them. I'll blow you away. God damn it, those guys are annoying. That was close. Sandwich going. What? I guess I'm supposed to exit them. Let me use that on them. And we're going down to the healing point. Do you for free? Can you go down, thank you. I really don't like having no healer. That's pretty much the only way to go, so let's go for him. Oh, what's going on here? Oh, hello Raven. Rita and... That's the last of them! Estelle, nice. <laughs> Looks like you guys have things under control. I've got my healer back, yeah. Hey, what gives? Come on, lay off, will you? <laughs> Are you okay? Were you hurt? Never been better. You worry too much. I thought I told you all to stay put for a while. What do you expect? We were worried about you. Hey, just for the record, I wasn't worrying about him. Well, I for one was worried sick. Yeah, right. Why would you bother coming all the way out here anyway? It's like this, see? The Don's having a fit, saying there's no way he'll let Barbos make a fool out of him. But I'm the one he sends to do his dirty work. What do you think you guys are doing coming in this way? Well, the front door was locked. That's not the point. Say hello to Dragon Rider, and lady. who might this lovely Critian be? Is she a princess? Laying it on a little thick there, old man. This is Judith. And we were locked up together. Hello. Hi, I'm Carol. I'm Estelise. But we all call her Estelle. Rita Mordio. And I am the great... Old Raven. man. 
<laughs> it's Raven. R A V E N. Raven. Raven the old you man. You have to wonder about people who introduce themselves like that. Hmm. That didn't quite have the zing I was looking for. I think that'll do for now. <laughs> what an interesting bunch of people. Ooh. I think she likes me. <laughs> Idiot. Judith, what were you doing in a place like this? I came to have a look at the Blastia. All the way out here? Why? I... She was captured while she was on a sort of research trip. Yeah, the Critia do like their research. <laughs> were you able to locate your Aqua Blastia? Nope, not this time either. I wonder if it's somewhere here in this tower. Oh, hello there. Oh, hey, Flynn. We have a full party of eight now. Right? Flynn? What's a lieutenant doing here all alone? We're short on manpower. Besides, I had no idea how dangerous it would be. Is everything going okay? The Don told everyone the truth, so things have calmed down. There is no longer any worry of conflict. My people have secured Rago's subordinates, and the Union has neutralized the town's mercenaries. All that's left is Barbos. Your Highness, it's terribly dangerous, so please stay here with Yuri and the others. It's far too dangerous for you to go all alone. We're going with you. No, I cannot permit that. Hold up, we've got a bit of history with Barbos, so we're not about to throw in the towel after coming this far. Besides, I'm pretty sure Estelle's just gonna go after you anyway. Yuri. <sighs> Very well. Then we'll go together. There isn't much time, and it should be safer this way. Everything settled? Then let's go. What is it, old man? Uh, nothing. Just thinking how you could really brag to your friends if you lived in a place like this. Hmm. <laughs> Repeat, come on. I guess you too, old man. You guess? What's that supposed to mean? Aren't What's you a little old for hide and seek? What's wrong oh. with poking your head out every once in a Suffer while? Suffer off guy. I think he called him Duke. These kids are really giving it a go. They could use your help every now and again. If such a necessity arises, I shall interfere. No such necessity exists now. Is he some kind of god or was the case? All right, all right. I know you've got your own business to take care of. I do not have the time for these clowning antics of yours. Jeez, watch where you're pointing words like that. The affairs of this world hold no interest for me. Of this world? What is he? Is, is he some kind of a god? Let me the title of best buddy. We joined the party. Cool. And reunited with everyone. Just use both. Hmm. What's up, Yuri? Is something wrong with your weapon? No, I was just thinking about how different axes and swords feel to use. Hmm. Ah, you use both swords and axes, don't you? Yeah, but my arts change depending on which I use. It's not a problem or anything, but... Hmm. Well, I think you look cooler when you're using axes, Yuri. It makes you look stronger, too. <clears throat> really? I prefer Yuri when he's using swords myself. You should just use one in each hand. <laughs> Give me a break. <laughs> That's cool. Alright, we have Flynn in the party. That seems cool. Flynn uses a sword. Oh my god. Oh my god, Flynn, why do you have to do all of that? And he uses a shield. He has hounds, he uses a knight sound, and knight's armor for the time being is probably better than anything else. Accessory, you get like, I don't know, another cape. Fine boots for now. Oh, let's keep, let's leave him there. I'm kind of curious how Flynn plays like. Demon Fang? He has first aid, so that's cool. Blazing Pillars, Magic Demon Scythe, Hellfire Blade. You know... We're gonna switch up the party a little bit, we're gonna leave Rita inside. We're gonna have Judah, Flynn, Rita... 
Carol is tell Raven and repeat as a backup. If we get now a special encounter, it's going from behind. I would probably want to repeat that here. Something like that. And then we want to go into here. Okay, we need to set up everything. I don't know what I want you to do, Flint. Let's give you strength, magic, and defend. Um, then what else could you get? Well, recover, item bro. Doesn't really much matter. Give you that, that. Give you everything, basically. Because you still need everything. Um, Judith is doing fine for now. Um, rest is fine, really. That's where we came from. What is that place? But questions don't want to go here. Okay. Did I fight those guys already? I did, so just... Oh, Flint seems pretty strong. I guess he got a card of invincibility frames there. You want revenge? Bring it. Cook now again. Let's leave Yuri on it for now. Why not? I've unlocked new strength. Colonel. Got a colonel. Yeah, we wanted to look at... Oh, touchy subject. You think we might cut down on the battles a bit? This old man can't take it for much longer. Really? We haven't been fighting any more than usual. Yeah, but keeping up with your youthful pace is killing me. Perhaps we should go with the pace of someone older and slower? Who are you calling older and slower? Don't worry. You're still young and full of life. Ah, yes. I'm glad you understand me at least, Judith, honey. He was the one who called himself an old man. Cut him some slack, Carol. People his age get sensitive about these things. <laughs> Alrighty, um... What did I, I... I want to look at his things. Knight Lieutenant, Flint Chifo. Already Lieutenant, and at such a young age. She's a little wet behind the ears, but that's a good thing. Best buddy, friends so close they can read each other's minds. When one's in trouble, the other comes running. Proud and just, he's the shining star of the Imperial Knights. He's not fully drained, but his heart is still in the right praise. place. Popular and highly skilled, he works tirelessly to turn his dreams into reality. The world is safer under his watch. I guess we have a full party now. At least that's what I'm guessing. Do you have anything new now? Go like here, synthesis. Not really. Yeah, nothing really new. But well, since it's already late for me, I'm gonna end it here for today. Probably grind a little bit off screen. We have now a full fledged party, it will be interesting. Getting Flynn and Yudif up to stuff. We'll see. Thank you all so much for watching and hopefully see you next time around. Tomorrow? What is tomorrow? Tomorrow we're going to continue with Tales of Vesperia. Tomorrow is Monday. At least most likely unless something else comes up. But I should be getting online at least for like a couple of hours. Anyway, that's it for today. Um, on Tuesday we continue with some programming, either with the mod or the API, I'm not sure yet, we'll see. Or we'll play maybe Dark Souls or Tales of Vesaria and get something um, to 100%, we'll see. Anyway, that's it for today. Once again, I thank you all so much for watching and hopefully have a nice day. Goodbye.